1822. Y'all know from our past videos talking about AEW. I'm all for AEW. I am looking forward to AEW October 2nd when they debut their show on TNT. But it's something I just read today from Resu News on Twitter about AEW. And I've been heard this for a while, and it's true. AEW will not go with the classic Hill versus Babyface character. And this is one of the main problems today in professional wrestling. AEW really think they're doing something different, not using Hill versus Babyface. This is pro wrestling. It's always been about Hill versus Face. Stop trying to be so cool and say, you know, it's not about Hill and Faces. The crowd decide who is the Hill or the Face. No, it's the performers. They don't know how to work the audience to make them draw booze, and that's the problem. Everybody want to be. You know, a cool hill, but they're not cool at all. You just don't know how to make a crowd boo you as a performer. When I look at someone like Daniel Bryan, who was the hottest baby face in the world of professional wrestling. Look at Daniel Bryan now. This guy is an excellent performer. He know how to draw heat. The only time he got um, cheers at the baby face when they go to Washington because, you know, he went to call Washington. He get cheers. But when it comes to every other city in the WWE where SmackDown be at, Daniel Bryan delivers as a hill. He get boo as a hill. Daniel Bryan know how to draw booze. AJ Styles right now is a hill. He is drawing booze. He is not getting face reaction. That's the main problem with so many talents today. They suck at getting the crowd to boo them because they don't know how to be characters. They do moves to get cheered. Do moves not to get cheered. When you watch AJ Styles turn hill, he cut down his high fly ability because he don't want to get cheered from the crowd. That's the part of being the hill. Same for Danny Bryant. Danny Bryant is not continuing to say yes, yes, yes after every single kick. So AEW, if you want to be different, have your hills draw booze from the crowd and not get a cheer every single time. You know, they talk about things like you know, with Cody Rhodes. Because when I watch Cody Rhodes, I'm not sure he's a hill or a face. And I do not like not knowing what you are because wrestlers are supposed to be cares. Can you imagine if Marvel all of a sudden said, you know what, in 2020, it's not about villains versus good guys. We just don't know. So Thanos, you know what? He can be anything. No, Thanos is a villain. And that's what makes him so great as a villain. What is up with today's pro wrestling? How are you going to come out and say it's not about hoods versus baby faces? It will always be like that. This is entertainment. We need hills and faces. I don't ever want to watch Marvels or DC not have villains versus um superheroes. Like, oh my, I just can't imagine it. Like, they just anything. No, it's not supposed to be like that. You always will have your villains. In your superhero, it will always be like that. Hell, like that reality. You hate good people, you hate bad people. But now they want to, you know, be different from other promotions, not have hills versus faces. That's stupid. When I watch a guy like MJF, I see a hill. So what you want to do, with MJF? Then sometimes he act like a face. Then act like a hill. He got to remain who he is. MJF. MJF know how to draw booze from the crowd. That's why he's my favorite AEW wrestler because he know how to draw a reaction. I am so upset by this news right here because I am going to support AEW. But I don't want to see stupid stuff like this not having baby faces and not having your heels. It's just whatever. Who are they? So now, when I watch John Moxley must down the line with entry, what is he? I mean, so now we don't know who these people are now. And that's stupid. You should always know, are you a baby face or you're a hill? Now, we just don't know now. They just on TV doing stuff. So, Sean Spears hit Corderos with a cheer, but he's not a hill. How does that make sense? So, if he's not a hill, what's the point of getting sympathy from Corderos getting hit with a cheer if he's not a hill? 
So why should I care about Sean Spear versus Cody Rhodes if it's not about heels and faces? Because if I see someone get hit by a chair, I'm going to want to root for the big face to beat that heel because he hit him with a goddamn chair. Ugh. Come on, AEW. Quit trying to be cool because that's not the cool way to do it. The cool way to do it is head heel and big faces and head heels that know how to be heels and get boo like MJF. That's all you got to do. So many talents today, all of them they care about is being good in the rank and this. They don't care about microphone skills. They don't care about storytelling. They don't care about becoming a character. They just want to be a good wrestler. But here's the thing. If you want to be on W level someday or try to surpass W level someday, just being good in the rank won't cut it. You have to do more with your product. You have to be heel and baby faces. You cannot just have people just be whatever because that's not cool. That's not cool at all to watch on television. I want my character to be heels and baby faces and know how to be a good face and know how to be a good heel. That's the special part about pro wrestling. When Ho Hogan turned heel, they just didn't say, well, Ho Hogan just became whatever in MDLO. No, Ho Hogan was a heel. Even though Hogan drew tears because he's Ho Hogan, he still got booze as Hollywood Hogan. We call that the greatest heel turn to the chain of professional wrestling. So what you want to call Sun No to change the business? What do you call it? If Sun become very hot and it brings so much attention to pro wrestling, reigns go, what the hell do you call it then? You call it a face turn or you call it a heel turn? What the hell do you call it? Come on, AEW. Stop the nonsense. Continue with the heel versus face thing, which always been involved with pro wrestling. Quit trying to be cool. Saying, you know, we're going to be totally different from other promotions and we're not going to use the classic baby face hill because it's stupid at the end of the day. So give me y'all thoughts on the video right here about AEW, the stupidity of not doing hill versus baby face. Don't forget, hit the subscribe button. I'm out. Peace.